Hey guys, gonna be doing some Jack O' Lantern gameplay here today on North America's version of Lost Saga. A happy Halloween to everyone. Uh, Jacko, pretty fun character. You can do a lot of great things with his dash attack and his ghost and all kinds of good stuff. He's got a lot going on for him. Uh, so here we go, a little bit of a ghost combo. Uh, I'm out of passive, so when you're out of passive, you can pretty much go into another character uh, really, really well. It works out very awesomely. Let's go ahead and try to ghost him. Ah, nope. And you can really, really surprise people with the dash attack as well. Like, they don't see you coming half the time. Like, just there, he was just, you know, doing his little pressure game, and I snuck in just like that and tried to uh, surprise both of them. So let's go ahead and ghost off the pumpkin. That's a pretty good setup off the default helmet. The default helmet's really hard to land most of the time, however, though. And you can actually ghost off your um, your basics here and there, especially if you got them in a juggle situation. It works out really nicely. Oh, got my counter attack. Looks like they did explode off of it. That was pretty cool. Uh oh, we got Wanderer with a kill. Let's go ahead and pop this ghost on this guy. There we go. Do another one. And now we can go into Dark Knight off that. That works out really nice. Something like Dark Knight off when you're low on passive to capitalize off that juggle is really, really good. And, uh oh, let's go ahead and use that nice trinket to recover from all that gobbledygook. Let's go ahead and pop this weapon skill, explode some fools. And that guy got out of it with the DMR. A little bit of lag there, it looked like, but that's okay. Oh, try to get him. Oh no, this could be bad. Oh, it's gonna get me in a DK juggle, almost. Oh, let's get out of that junk. Okay, let's pop this pumpkin and see if we can get that kill. Or one of these kills. Pop this pumpkin. Be a pumpkin header. Sneak in on this guy. There we go. Actually, kind of got him. Went for that ghost on the uh, Nangan, but it didn't work out too, too well. Got him. This can be a longer passive, too. Hit multiple people, but the DK hits me from so far back there. That's too bad for me. Because I had a double juggle situation there. It would have been really nice. Hit that DK in the back there. Hit this guy ghosted. If you hit it low enough to the ground, you can actually start your basic attacks off that. It works out a little bit better. Oh, got him. Go ahead and try the pumpkin again while they're busy with each other. If you're going to use a pumpkin, you need to use it on people who are kind of uh, busy a lot of times. Got my weapon skill ready. I'm ready to use it. If I can catch one of these guys. Got a little of it off, but not really what I wanted there. Let's go ahead and try for this. Gotta be careful about DKs a lot of times. Let's go for that. Uh oh. Whoa, that's close. Alright, let's see if we can surprise one of these guys. Uh oh, okay, let's pop this pumpkin down. Oh. Okay, I had my recovery there, just in case. And you can use actually use a recovery twice, it works really nicely. Like right here, I could have used it. Uh, but I don't know, maybe I was just messing up there. <laughs> Got him with the ghost. And he recovers off of it with gooey ears of all things. Got a kill. All right, now we got a 1v1 situation, which means we can use our dash mix-up to keep people on their toes guessing. All right, let's get out of that. Nothing like dashing on Jacko. It's just so so much movement behind it. Oh, Wanderer. Uh-oh. Oh, a puppeteer thing hit me. Uh-oh, that's bad. Oh, no, he got me. But not really a great place for him to combo there, though. Alright, got the Alisu. Let's go ahead and pop the weapon skill. Let's see if we can hit the Alisu. You can also use your ghost off your dasher, by the way. So remember that you can use that off your dasher because it really catches people off guard if they think they're out of range of your dasher. And then you throw out the ghost instead. It's really awesome. I got a ghost there. Not much time on the ghost uh, cooldown, however. Pretty hard to work with sometimes. Pop this uh, pumpkin here. Oh, perfect time for the pumpkin, too. Oh, perfect time. Perfect timing. Try the pumpkin head here. Oh, a little bit laggy it looked like there. Oh! Let's try for a ghost. Got him. Oh, no. 
probably could have used my recovery there, but I did not. Hit that ghost. Got him. More ghosts on the way. Oh no! Connection slow! I may have just misnamed it though. Alright, let's try the weapon skill here. Oh yeah! Yes! Good stuff. Toss that pumpkin there. Oh no! Got interrupted though. Ooh. Oh no! Let's go and pop that. I was worried about that striker there. I actually got him with that. That was good. Let's pop this pumpkin here. Oh, look at my timing. It's impeccable today. Here we go again. Oh no, I'm getting frozen. I was hoping my pumpkin would have like helped me out there a little bit. And this thing will not work on Jack Lantern because he can float back. It just takes a little bit of passive to get back from that. Try to get six here. Nope. There's uh, the Alisu again, once more. Got him with the ghost. Alisu might actually get me here. Though. Oh, I jumped into it. Goodness. Look at that, the Alisu. Almost. Try that ghost. Actually, traveled that far to get him. Can't swap to my DK to really do much there. Alright, here we go. We got a chance to use this weapon skill. This should hit a few people. Oh no, I probably won't work on the Alice, to be honest though. <laughs> Pardon me there guys, I had a little bit of a coughing fit. <laughs> okay, Alice you, let's get him. Probably should have swapped to Dark Knight once again there. Got him. Oh, someone spawned. That's no good for me. Oh no! <laughs> Edge myself! Don't need to give that Alice uh, any undue credit, because that's going to be hard to compete with him if I'm giving him free drop damage. Alright, who we got here? Black. Got him. Oh no, 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 no! I didn't want to get that ice. Uh oh. I can get back from this at least. <laughs> he just edged himself trying to get me. Let's see. Gotta worry about that dark knight back there too. It's that uh, gumshoe there. Alright. I was wanting to do a pump in there, but it didn't really come to pass. Oh, the ghost didn't work out too well. Alright, Wandera, me and you. It's an okay first round, it seemed like. Let's see how we did. Batter King. Punching bag. I didn't get punching bag, so went okay, went okay. Pretty good around there. So let's do one more with some epics on or so, guys. So gonna do one more match with Jacko this time, guys. We're gonna be using Thunderbird Helmet, uh, Phantom Armor, and Dark Knight Trinket. So um, mostly for the LOLs with the with the Thunderbird Helmet. Uh, the rest, you know, not too big a deal. Try to get this guy with a ghost. Feel like I'm getting stalked by Zeos while he's getting hit by a ninja. Tried for a ghost there. Didn't work out too well. Oh, look out. Launcher here. Let's just go ahead and do a quick edger on him. Oh, no. Got hit by that dragon slayer. There we go. Launcher. Oh, I did I did have a juggle, but it was just kind of lagged out a little bit there. Tried for that. Oh, the barbarian got a nice double hit on us there. That was good. All right, so what do we got here? Let's try and ghost from long range here. Oh, gotta watch out for the... Oh, no. Let's get out of that. Alright. Oh, no, 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 no. Where did he come from? Oh, my gosh. I want to use some skills. Alright, let's try this. Oh, no. Got hit by something else. Oh, no. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I want to use my stuff before I die. Here we go. Beautiful. Alright, let's try this. I don't think I'm going to hit anyone with that, actually. Let's go ahead and thunder tackle people. Here we go. That was fun. <laughs> All right, what do we got over here? Okay, this guy has got safety armor on, so it's kind of hard to work with that. All right, let's try to get him. Whew. So much st 
stuff happening. Oh, she got me, pressured me off there. Good job by Queenie. A little bit of a hit there. Could have potentially killed him. Gotta watch out for that guy using it. Uh... Ooh. Went for that guy. Oh, look out. Oh, got fainted. Luckily, she didn't hit me with them anymore. Got her. There we go. Swap to Dark Knight. There we go. Sometimes you gotta make use, make do with the Dark Knight. Got him. Tricked him out a little bit there. Ha! Ah, caught him again. Oh no, couldn't couldn't juggle him that time though. Oh, oh, he could have fainted off that. Caught him. I'm missing up the opportunities though. Oh, that was close. Try for another ghost. This should be able to kill him, I think. Oh, I just blew it though. Caught him. Yes. Uh oh, look out. This isn't good. <laughs> it's the devil. Alright. Went for a ghost, but didn't quite get it. Alright, tell you what, let's pop the Dark Knight trinket here. That will work really, really nicely. Hit Nostalgic Child. Go ahead and go for Queen over here, too. Try to scare her off a ledge. It's Halloween, so we gotta do that kind of thing. Oh, look out. Poison. Whoa, that's close. Oh! DMR! This might end up edging me. Let's see. Yep. Got edged. It's okay. We got a lot of deeps before we got edged, so it worked out. Alright, here we go. Juggle time. Swap to Dark Knight. Swap back to Jacko. Ah, I missed a little bit of a juggle there. Got him. Don't have enough for the other things there, though. Feels like my Thunderbird helmet is not really working too too well right now. Uh oh, look out. Probably could kill Queen here. Let's go for this Destroyer. He's getting kind of annoying. Uh-oh, look out. Let's go ahead and charge before I die. Oh, no. Okay, here we go. Ooh, that was close. So we'll try and kill this guy over here. Tom Bay. Didn't quite wasn't quite enough to kill him, but we did get him pretty low. Oh he got me! And two down with the monk helmet there. Caught the destroyer. Tried the counter, but it didn't work out too too well. Can't get Tombe for some reason. Go for Queen instead, I guess. Uh oh, D'Artagnan helmet. Oh, she caught me with that last hit. Oh, nice hit by the Reaper there. That dash is still really good, I think. A lot of people don't use it anymore, but it's still good. I get dude's trying to use all his skills on me. Oh, that didn't hit him. All right, nice, nice faint there. Oh man. Okay, I need to stop chasing him. He's just gonna play keep away all day. Only one who's been really willing to fight me, like straight on. Seems like it's tension. Let's go ahead and pop this. Try to scare these guys off the ledge. Oh no, I got scared, spooked there. I don't want to lose. Don't want to lose my scares. I'm okay, I'm okay. Shocking. <laughs> Alright, this should be good. Try to kill Ryu Kai. Oh boy, I killed myself though. <laughs> I did kill him at least. So that's something. I 
go stop. I actually got my juggle there. Try to chase this sucker down here. This old rascal. <laughs> Went for the ghost there, but didn't quite get it. Oh no, walked right into that one. Put a little delay on that little spin. Oh no, just says myself, who's in who's in second? I gotta watch out for some of these guys. Got him! Oh, I didn't quite get everything I wanted from that though. Tell you what, oh wait, I didn't want to use that. No! I set myself up for that one. Oh no! Come on, let me up, let me up. Oh no! Just getting hit by everything here. This is bad. I want to use my skills before the round ends. Here we go. Here we go. I got a little something out there. Okay, got my uh, pumpkins out. I think I may have squeezed out first place there. We'll see. We'll see. I was stuck in a really tough position with that poison there. <laughs> oh, yes, I did it! Jacko with the Thundo hat. So let's head on head on into HQ here and discuss a few things really quick, guys, before ending the video. So just to cover a few more things about Jacko here, guys. Uh, you know, Jacko, you've got a lot of great mobility options with his dashing. Really, really nice. He can cover the map in no time. Look at that sucker go. <laughs> uh, he, he can be really good at that kind of thing. Uh, other things, you know, you got your dasher off your... your um, Pardon me, your launcher off your dasher, which goes into your four hit combo. And then you can do a lot of ghosty kind of combos as long as you've got the passive to work with. Uh, if you got the passive to work with, you know, you can do really well. Um, sometimes it's a good idea to let them kind of fall as you're doing this so you can get them. But you can see if you let them fall too much, your ghost is not going to connect with them. So that, that can mess things up kind of badly. Um, you know, once you have your ghost towards the end, like I stress, you need to use something like. Uh, um, you know, Dark Knight or something that's really, really good to capitalize off his last uh, ghost opportunities. Uh, Dark Knight, I feel, is like one of the best things off that. But you could use something like a Lucifer or maybe like even a Rachel would work okay. So a lot of things would work really, really nicely off his ghost as swap kind of uh, tag outs. Really nice. Uh, other things, you know, you can da you can use your ghost attack off your dash, and this will catch a lot of people off guard. A lot of people are really unfamiliar that you can actually use the ghost, the whole the ghost off your dash attack or your dash move right there, and that works really really well. Um, if you can ghost them low enough to the ground, you can actually go into basics, which works out really really nicely, really really good. Uh, other things, you know, your counter attack's very slow and it leaves you vulnerable. So if you're going to use your counter attack, be sure you really have your act together and you get the sucker out really, really well. Because if you don't get it out really well and you get blocked, you can be punished for it. Uh, but it, the rewards are very, very high. Very good counter attack if you can land it. Um, other things, you know, the air walking is a really important defensive kind of tool. Um, you know, when you air walk, you can avoid a lot of things. You can start jumping into someone and then you can turn around and walk away. Just walk away and someone will potentially throw out their skill on you and you'll end up safe because you're walking away. <laughs> um, other things, you know, you're, you're walking in the air, the D hit there, that can actually be a pretty good anti-air and chase tool as well. Usually you can't land it too well on moving targets, but if someone's trying to jump out of your pressure and you jump cancel, you can use it very quickly and catch them off guard and potentially anti-air them to set up some ground opportunities. So that works out very nicely. Um, other things, you know, your skills, skills are very good, uh, the weapon skill is very useful, a very wide area of effect, uh, good opportunity to juggle off it as well, you can ghost off of it if you can line it up correctly, uh, it works out beautifully, just need a little bit of a setup and keep in mind it doesn't have much invulnerability time, so don't let those uh, old rascals come up and hit you in the back as you're using it, because it'll ruin the skill. Uh, trick or treat, the default armor, a little bit hard to aim, but it does create kind of a uh, a little bit of a barrier for people and you know kind of a warning for people coming into that area like don't step into this area you little rascal you <laughs> um, you know your helmet skill your helmet skill is hard to land that hard to land most of the time but you know you can use your pumpkin ghost off of this 
pretty well for a combo start and it does have a very fast cooldown as well so works out nicely sometimes uh, your trinket skill very useful recovery if you're getting knocked off a ledge or something you can actually pull yourself back uh, works really really nicely and you can use it as an air recovery as well so uh, a lot of gears like gumi ears sometimes the momentum will still carry you off the ledge with this sucker right here you can actually cast it and be back in no time it has a few drawbacks however even though it's a, like a double double recovery skill if someone kills the lantern there they can end up pulling you into a bad skill like something like the something like the weapon skill on Jacko could end up putting you in peril or wanderer's weapon skill something like that so you gotta be a little bit mindful of things that will adversely affect you with that trinket there uh, for stats I would say this uh, this Jacko here he benefits from a little bit of strength uh, strength would be pretty good on him uh, speed you know he's already moving so fast so he doesn't really need any more juice behind those steps right there. Uh, other things he could use are, are his skills. He could be a skill kind of character. The weapon skill I feel like is pretty good and damaging and pretty useful for area control and juggle potential as well. It can be really nice and the trinket's a really great recovery if you can use it properly. Uh, the other skills I would kind of pass on. Uh, but that'll do it for Jacko here, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and I wish you all a happy, happy Halloween. Hope you, hope you get a lot of candy out there, or give a lot of candy out. Uh, spread some love, spread some happiness to all the little kids and stuff. Uh, be a good time, be a good time. So hopefully you enjoyed the video, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and hope to see you next time.